Welcome back once again. In our previous tutorial, we designed our model class. We, are, we inside our we added our model class, and in this part, we will insert our job inside our Firebase database. So we need to create two database. One is public and one is for normal database. So first, we need to we will work for our is user database. So so inside our button post job inside job post activity okay first we need to add our firebase auth and database reference so firebase so private firebase auth m auth private and database reference is going to be m database Or you can call it M job post. Now M auth is equal to Firebase auth dot get instance. Now we need to create our our Firebase user. So Firebase user M user is equal to M at M auth dot get current user. This way we will get our current user ID and we will store this one inside our database. And now we need to add a string variable. So a string UID is equal to m user dot get UID. Now our user ID is stored inside this UID. Now we need to create a database reference. So make sure that you added this three line of code. I mean that is required to create a unique user. And inside unique user, we will add our unique user job post. So now our database reference m job post is going to be firebase database dot get instance dot get reference dot child in here we need to add our database name and we can call it job post and dot child and inside the job post we need to will add our this we will add our user id and inside our user id we will add our all this job post so make sure that you are you added this line of code so we created our database and our database name is job post okay now go to this button job post set on click listener button post job set on click listener and in here in our previous part we added all this condition now we need to we are ready to insert this data so before that we need to add id so string id m job post dot push dot get key this push dash get key will give us a random key inside our user inside our database so now we need to generate our date so date is equal to first we need to string date is equal to date from a dot get date instance so date format dot get date instance dot format new new date so now our data is equal to new data and open this model class and make sure that we are at in same sequence so first one is title description skill salary and id and last one is date so the title description so title description skills salary and our id and last one is our date all right now our m job post dot child child and our child is our id and dot set value is going to be data 
So all this functionality done for insert our data to our Firebase database. So I think that's it for this part.